you uh, easily keep pace with the, the goblin, and we'll be able to swing at it again next, next round and probably officially kill it off. The girl that is helping you drag the, the crane samurai along uh, lets go of him and um, darts off into the, the fog. Uh. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> in, in which but why? Uh, she she, she returns a, a moment later, um, having procured a, an oar, a oh. boat oar. Oh, excellent! Which she then starts trying to hit the goblin with, <laughs> 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 or not really hit, more like poke at angrily but she's annoying it more than anything just repeatedly shaking my head no 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 <laughs> <laughs> now she's employing the ancient daidoji iron warrior spear technique <laughs> <laughs> however she explodes. forgot her spear tip <laughs> look, I, look if you, always believe in the dice <laughs> She's annoyed it enough that it, it lets go of the crane's legs to grab the she, oar. Yeah, she's got. I was gonna say, yeah, she's she's got. She's got aggro. <laughs> and we are now to, to Nick. They are within sight now. You can see this playing out. I swear to God, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I can see there. It was a goblin and a and someone fighting over an oar. And it's, it's a, a well-dressed woman with white hair and blue and uh, white robes. And you, you, can also, you might not I be able to recognize family, Matsu. but you could identify a, a, a clan. What you fucking yeah. call me? <laughs> I no, can punch the... yourself out. Come here. <laughs> and, and next to the girl who's fighting with the goblin over the oar, there is a... Right. Uh, no, so it, Nick was asking if he if he Nick was asking if he'd still be able to see me, but I don't I don't think we were able to see each other at all. Probably. Uh, I mean, you started off in front of the same building I was in. Oh, okay. I went outside. Ah, but yeah, I, I I moved up a bit to attack a thing, so they're probably a lot closer to you. All right, I'm gonna go help this old lady. I'm assuming she's old, she no. has white hair. No. The a lot of the crane a lot of the crane bleached their hair white, so you'd be able to see that. Yeah, the, the man in the armor that they're dragging also has the bleached white hair. I'm go help this old lady then. Right. Uh, Obacha. Oh, <laughs> so it's a roll. All right. So this time I'm rolling hit with my katana, uh, uh, which is. Someone please explain to me how I calculate that. Uh, what are you calculating? Sorry. Uh, it's a rolled hit with Kenjutsu. It it is the same way you would do your Yajutsu, except it is agility Kenjutsu instead of reflexes Yajutsu. Right. So. But you will have your plus three since you have an emphasis in katana. So like plus three flat out on the end of it. So that would be still a six keep three. Like it is. Lit it's literally the same roll for you, except a plus three at the end. I'm gonna six keep, six keep three raise raise twice, which is what seven keep four. No, 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 no. You, the the raise is is as a result uh, if you succeed. So so if you call two raises, that will increase the TN of what you're trying to do uh, by two increments of five. But if you do succeed in those two raises, you will get uh, it will turn your roll into a uh, seven keep three for or no. For like damage. Got it. All right. I guess so I'll... she'll calculate essentially. Yeah. You do two raises, it'll increase its defense by two yeah. sets of five. So you don't know if you're gonna hit until. 20... Gotcha. Twenty-four. Roll your damage. Yeah. So it's one raise easy. gives you an extra rolled die. Two raises gives you an extra rolled and kept die. And then it goes in that, uh, so and then three raises is two unkept die and one kept, something like that. So, you, so your normal damage roll is 
70, 70, 10, K3. Yes. Oh, you, uh, you didn't put your exclamation points, so, uh, go ahead and roll on, like, another D10 to add on to that 10 that you rolled, since it exploded. That was not the button I needed to hit. So just another D10. Do you know what sucks? My push talk being the same button that goes back in front of us. Yeah. <laughs> that, uh... Okay, uh, roll another D10. Again! <laughs> like, make, make, see, exploding is wonderful. <laughs> okay. Right, so, so add a... Add a 36? Yeah. Is that what that means? Cool. Yes. Yeah. Feels good, don't it? It's <laughs> alright. This is all downhill from here, by the way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, th th this is inherent Ronin bonuses. <laughs> alright, you stepped in where the, the thing had been reaching out with both hands to jerk the ore out of the girl's hands, Holy. and you just take both of its arms off, like... Right at the elbows. Nice. Look, to quote Wooly Madden, look, he pulled a gun on a cop. Hands up, don't shoot. Yeah. Fucking Wooly. Blood starts spraying, like, everywhere. Yeah. But he's gonna need to go to the temple after this. But is it still alive? It, it is still alive. Alright, I'll props, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> You're pretty strong. <laughs> I'll keep dragging this guy. I know I wouldn't be still alive if someone took both my arms off. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's not really doing much of anything but flailing around just at the moment. But it, it's flailing around. Hey, a, a very a sh a severed, like... Arm bone can be very dangerous. Flail in the right direction. <laughs> Things to be sharp. Don't get killed by the armless goblin. <laughs> <laughs> Look, mine had one arm and it got me good. Matsu's going to enter full attack stance. Okay. And, uh... I am going to call... the same, uh... two raises to attack this goblin. Okay. Okay. And, uh, with my... two free raises from being in full attack stance... The extra one I get from my school for damage, and my other bullshit, that's going to be six raises for damage. Oh, fuck this goblin. <laughs> <laughs> Still no explosions, god damn it. <laughs> well, it's okay, because, cause, uh... Man, I must be ashamed not really having explosions then, Ryan. <laughs> Just tell me if you need a hand with that, I'm, I think I can... <laughs> you actually can. If you spend two void points, you can, uh, or you can spend a void point on someone else's behalf. Yep. Uh, it is called encouragement. As a com as a comrade performs an action, you may encourage him in some manner as long as he can hear you. You can spend two void points, and they immediately gain a void point to spend on the roll. All right. You do a swipe up past the area where it now has no arm to defend with, uh, and slice clean through. The, the chest and out the other side. Uh. Falls down in two pieces. What is this? He is going to uh, retreat back to the entrance of the inn because. As you are heading in that talk. direction, oh, you hello. will see the monk dragging the crane, uh. as well as uh, the, the Ronin standing there and the, the goblin flailing around with no arms. Uh, are they headed to the inn or where are they headed? They seem to be heading in the direction of the inn, yes. Okay. Matsu will call out that 
uh, you, know, sa- you know, general like safety in the inn, and that he and that he is guarding the inn <laughs> as he is very covered in blood. Okay, well, I'll heed the crazy guy. And is it the end of one right now? Have a what? Me zero. What do you say when you go full attack posture, you're down to like a. Well, well, okay. Well, she, it could be Tiana if she doesn't use it for attack. It could be still Tiana fifteen, but she gets uh, a plus uh, two keep one on any damage roll. But yes. Gotcha. But but how Matsu do is I kill them before they attack me usually. <laughs> usually. You'll have to teach me that one sometime. Yeah. Defense no. No, no, no. Matsu are very short-lived. <laughs> All right, Kenji. Um, you can uh, hear the gate beginning to like grind open, though there's a lot of cracking at the same time as it was pretty badly damaged by the ogre's attacks. Okay. They're, they're probably damaging the gate further in the process of, of getting it open. All right. But it, it is beginning to, to grind open. Slowly but surely. Um, Ryan, how does uh, how does full defense posture work? Uh, you call it the start of your turn. You will roll uh, agility plus defense. Keep uh, your agility. And let me see here. Then you add that to your. Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm trying to see if it if it adds to it or if it replaces. Since that is a very slightly different, uh, it's a very very different. I thought it was add, add on top of it is what I read. Yeah. You said reflexes. I said agility. Oh. Plus your skill and defense, keep agility, right. and whatever that is should be. What special kind of situations? Where is? Where would this even be in the game mechanics? You make an agility defense skill roll, add the yeah. result to your TN to be hit. Until yeah, then, there we go. Yeah. Around, yeah. There you go, Brian. Alright. Um, Do that? Is that your plan? Despite, yeah, despite not having any uh, any okay. uh, reduced attack roll garbage for my wounds, I still yeah. feel like not dying would probably be good. Yeah. And keep in mind, in full defense, uh, attacking takes you out of it, and you move at half speed. But cool. Yeah. That's but you know, problem. also not dying. Yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna be a, a brick. He breaks his foot on me or something. Uh, all right. So is that just for this turn? I presume. That that's for this round. This yes. Round. Yeah. All right, so my TN for this round is going to be 44. Cool. Until, right. Okay, sorry. Until you leave full defense, I should say. Sorry. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, I'll just be a brick for a while. And end my turn. You could move. Or are you just really liking that uh that tree you're caught up in? He has to roll the next round. This is the ground on which we will fight. Oh, he does have to roll the next round? Okay. Yeah, it, it lasts and uh, okay, and then you reroll it. I've never been in full defense for more than one turn, so <laughs> it only um, applies to the amount of opponents equal to your entire rank. I guess so, if I yeah, if I one. can move even in my reduced movement mode, could I uh, reach my Tetsubo and at least pick it back up? Yes. All right, yeah, you can I get will, that far. I will do that and then be a brick. What's your movement? Twenty. I have no idea. Uh, what's your water ring? Oh, bad. Two. Two? Yeah, your normal move. Your normal movement's twenty, so your movement's ten right now. Uh, yards, I presume, or meters. Uh, feet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I can only move. No, normally, I can only move twenty feet in six seconds. <laughs> You're also wearing heavy armor. Yeah, but I take no. Uh, I know. Take no yeah, well, well, Brian. <laughs> I can move 50 feet in 6 seconds. So. I'm sorry, Brian. You'll have to uh, show me the calculations for the uh, movement speed of a brick. <laughs> <laughs> well, if it's a South African brick, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to 
I'm gonna make this macro and just call it Become Brick. Speaking of that, did you look at some of the uh, crab katas? Um, like specific ones? Yeah, there's some Not really. I pretty much stopped it. Right oh. One. Oh wait, holy shit! Hold on, one second. Um. So, I might say, since I didn't know that you could take this at a rank 1, because I because none of the uh, line ones can take a rank 1, there's totally a crab-specific one that you can take at rank 1, so I'd throw this past uh, uh, Jeanette if, you, if she'd let you retcon that, but um, instead of, like, striking this earth. But there is a crab-specific one that is... Uh, you can take a Hitabushi 1 that costs the same amount of experience. Uh, for all intents and purposes, pretty much yes, Jay. But a uh, Shell of Stone, Brian, and that is uh, when you use this kata, you may either double your effective defense skill or double the bonus gain from wearing heavy armor. You may not declare full attack, and you roll one fewer die for initiative and attack rules. Damn. And it's the that same cost. Brickage. Yeah. <laughs> so I didn't I didn't know that was there, so since you haven't even used Striking as Earth yet, I'd still put that past uh um gel if you could like if you wanted to swap that for Striking as Earth. Nah, I gotta no? be an imperfect character. <laughs> Shove <Shop> stone. <laughs> Alright, Cody. <laughs> Brian, it's a it doubles your TN bonus yeah, from heavy armor. Apparently no no more uh, goblin playing tug of war with you to get the guy into the inn, and you're oh, right sweet. there. So, gonna drag him on in there. And... Yeah, Nick got it good. Well, it's not dead yet, but he got it good. Got got. Get, get him at least slightly in the door. And then, is there anybody else in here that could maybe take him? Uh, there are several peasants uh, it, huddled in various corners, as well as a uh, very well dressed man. Uh, looks like a scribe. You see, ink stained mm. hands and sleeves. Uh, one of you wouldn't mind uh, pulling him further in here, would would you? Several of the peasants moved to to help. Give him a, remember, a super quick bow. remember, the girl follows as, in behind, kind of shaking and covered in goblin blood. I will say that. Uh, <laughs> remember, as hard. members of the samurai cast, you can't touch dead bodies. That's what peasants are for. We, no, we have edda, we have edas. <laughs> we have edas for that. Listen, we have peasants trained to do that, Nick. What I do in my own free time ain't nobody's business. <laughs> <laughs> so they're poking down. I paid the coroner good money. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I'll leave him in there and then uh, run back outside. Okay. And assumedly my friend who was going to have his wedding is in the main place? Yes, he'd be in the, the manor house. Get off me, Gil. Sorry, dog's jumping on me. Uh, and I'm gonna... run past the, the crazy guy covered in blood towards that. Alright. Give him a, a... a short nod. <laughs> Give him a wide berth as well. As he <laughs> clearly grunts at me. As he as looks ready to swing at anything that moves in his peripheral. <laughs> yeah, just gonna scoot around him and run towards the manor. Alright. And assuming they run into... Uh, are we out of combat? No. Oh, okay. it, you, you, it, you in the end? Probably. I don't know. That's your uh, yeah, decision. I was, uh, <laughs> have I gone to the end? Was that stated? Do you want? Do you yeah, want? Any, anybody who is inside the inn is is going to be considered officially out of yeah, combat if they wish to be. Head in the inn as well. Do that one is my turn. Don't worry. There's I'll not do that out here. 
Yeah, I didn't see any ogre. <laughs> I want I want to hit that ogre really badly. In that I, like I want to get a hit in so bad. <laughs> but Matsu's doing his part. So do I run into anybody? Where on the map is the entrance to the inn? Uh, you actually have to dive into the pond. <laughs> pond Sword connect. Style. You have to. Swim. No, the the en the entrance is over here in the manor, but you gotta swim up through the uh, yep, through the tunnel <laughs> for here. They're connected. Pond to pond. Uh, I'm gonna the say they're, they're, the entrance that they were guarding is um. Where was I? Like over here on, like, because I can make uh, it on this way. side. And there's like a little side entrance, like yeah. over here. Well, I, I I wouldn't call this exact distant measurement for this map exact. Yeah, it's, it's, it's not. That is, so yeah, not yeah, a ten. That, <laughs> that this building is five <laughs> feet long. You know, in yeah. Japan. We are we are very <laughs> the Rukugane are a small people. <laughs> but no, there's there was one entrance that was probably like I don't know hereish, and another that's like in this little wall here. Okay. This this right here is okay. Matsu Death Zone. Is where he's been hanging out. This is where we came out of the inn, or did we come out of? This uh, place? probably hereish. I don't know. Either way, this is where Matsu Death Zone is happening. Okay, I All right. that way. Well, I'm so, up yeah, yeah, so, so, yeah, so Jay, you're probably up here. Engaging a goblin. Because I was running towards this too at one point. Yeah, probably run around that too. Because uh, she's probably fine. <laughs> she's chasing it's a, a goblin. It's an Akoto. You, you can, the the you goblin can... is running off in that direction. <laughs> Would I make it to the ogre? Uh, you will probably make it to the point where you can see the ogre, like, looming out of the fog, but its attention is not at all on you at this yeah. point. Uh, you wouldn't be able to attack it yet this turn, but you can you can still see it. Are the gates open yet, or no? Uh, the gates are open enough that people can start coming through them, yes. Uh, the ogre is taking a swing at the target it is focused on. <clears throat> this time, Eight. bringing the, the Tetsubo down again. <laughs> Look, Nick, do I, need to, do I need to talk to you exactly the attitude that the Matsu have? Because that's how you get challenged to, a, like, some sort of competition. <laughs> or, he ta or he then just, you know... You know what? No, 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 no. The, the response to that is him uh, promising to take one of your arms off to even that score. All right. Um, it brings the club back around in a big, slow swing that you see coming from quite some ways away and are able to just roll out of the way of. Uh, <laughs> the tree does not fare well, but you are untouched. <laughs> good news, good news. This tree? Or this tree? I Which would... tree? That one. This, this this one. The one we're pointing to. Right here. This one here? I, 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 I appreciate that we all moved using the ruler so we don't just like clutter up the map with our bullshit drawing. <laughs> <laughs> just, just use it to like point. Like this thing, yeah, like, eh. It's no, we're making it's, them touch. It's this one. This one over here. Yeah. Right here? Oh, it's yeah. the top one. Yeah. Make them touch. Poor tree. Oops. Jay, your fleeing goblin encounters another goblin in the 
fog and kind of ducks around behind it. Fucking tags him in. That goblin is kneeling over uh, one of the fallen peasants. My goblin is fleeing. Yeah, you were chasing it, I think. Yeah. It's oh. got a clawed hand set down on the, the peasant's chest. And uh, as you approach, that peasant starts moving again. Uh, I'm gonna slice at the goblin that's on the woman, I guess. Or peasant. I just assumed it was a girl. I don't know, could be a dude. <laughs> it's a dude, fuck him. <laughs> it's a peasant. Okay, there, there are no laws stopping samurai from just killing peasants. You totally can do that. What just are we saying. Doing here? <laughs> <laughs> it, it, Take your attack. Alright. Kick him in the growl. <laughs> Kick it in the face. Just get, just get real thug on it. <laughs> as an Okotobushi, square up, nigga. as a rank one Okotobushi, I can ignore the armor of a foe or gain a free raise when attacking. So, uh, if if you want to gain a free raise for attacking, that basically kind of like a s the way you consider that attacking. If you you can either apply that for damage for. For like a uh, a free unkept or an unkept iron damage roll, or reducing its TN by five, so like, which is effectively increasing your attack roll by five. I'll do reducing its TN by five. Yeah. Oh, rolling out of the time. So one D ten, keep one. I mean I'm pretty sure I mean I'm pretty sure you're hitting it, but I wanna see. Oh god, get the get the cards out of here. Gaijin Gaijin gear playing cards. Anyone wanna play some poker? I'm clicking on them. God. <laughs> Where did this come from? I drew a six of the hearts. <laughs> drew an ace. Okay. So yeah. <laughs> so I think you hit forty three. You know, I'm just just an Or effectively uh forty forty eight. Should have called some raises. <laughs> Should have called some raises. Casual. <laughs> I don't know. Did, uh, did I hit? Yeah. Clearly, the goblins you guys are coming across are scrubs. So I'm hitting some sort of like pro Genji on mine. Yeah, yeah, that that would hit. <clears throat> it's oh, just man. time to roll damage. I was denied my last three thefts. Oh, okay, rolling damage. Yep. I got distracted by the cards. God, good lord. <sighs> I can put it on the board. God damn! It. I don't know how to get rid of them. I don't know either. I can rotate it. Gambit. <laughs> Holy take crap! Card. Oh, you right click it and do take card. Where did these cards come from? I'm gonna raise. Oh, uh, forty ten. Wait, hold on. Your, no, no, the poker game your damage roll with the katana should be a. Uh, Got a pretty good hand. Should be a uh, regularly, what sixty ten keep two. Don't you fucking take my sh shit? No, I need the. It's... Fine, whatever. Jay, <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's your damage roll. Not that one. 
What do you mean? The... Oh, yeah, that's right. Well, the damage on, on a katana is regularly 3 keep 2, <sighs> and adding your strength in that would be 6 keep 2. But keep the 26. Is that what it would be? Well, yeah, you, you add your strength to the, uh, to the, um, roll oh. die. I don't know why I did 4. I mean, by all means, I just roll two more die and add it to it. Keep keep that twenty six. <laughs> yeah, just just roll two more dice. Okay. <clears throat> In the middle of this, like, and if they happen to be like higher than the seven or the two, we can add yeah. those instead of the. We'll keep. We're in the middle of this, like, Shadowlands assault, and you guys are just, like, taking play cards and licking them and sticking them to your foreheads. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, one of them was definitely right. higher. Yeah. yeah, so 35 plus 26. I think you 45. hit it. I, I, I think you got it. Alright, that makes it 52 total. Which, uh, yeah. I don't know, I came across a pretty tough goblin. Must be some sort of, like, special elite force. <laughs> so you come running in at the very distracted goblin and just take its head clean off. Fantastic. It, uh, collapses on top of the the corpse, which stops moving. Uh, tendrils of nasty black smoke kind of leak out of the mouth, but Whoa. otherwise it it ceases its jerking about. That's some bad juju. <laughs> or a uh, wooj, as my old GM would call magic in this game. Just wooj it a bit. <laughs> All right, and I'm gonna call like a five-minute bathroom break. Just okay. I need one. Awesome. I'm gonna get my just glasses. in case anyone else does. No, I'm a robot. I'm good. All right. I'll, I'll be back, back in a moment. I'm a robot, so I need gin. Mmm. Do that Riesling chunk.